Engineer 775 here, again at Heritage Life Skills and meeting a lot of great folks. A buddy of mine told me about this author, Franklin Horton, and I get to meet him today. So Franklin, introduce yourself and tell me about your books. Sure. My name is Franklin Horton. I'm from Southwest Virginia. Uh, the series of books is The Borrowed World. Uh, the first one came out in May of last year and I've released three with the last one, Legion of Despair, coming out about three weeks ago. Uh, it's the story of a businessman in Virginia who's on a business trip to Richmond with a group of co-workers. And there's a coordinated ISIS terror attack against infrastructure targets. They hit fuel refineries, dams, bridges, uh, weaknesses in the electrical grid. And uh, the result is that executive orders go into place restricting the fuel supply. So uh, as a result, travelers around the country end up stuck wherever they are on the highways. So this guy who is with a group of people he doesn't necessarily get along with or have political agreements with, uh, they find themselves having to make their way home from Richmond to Southwest Virginia. So it's a, a difficult trip. Uh, it jumps back and forth between his experience on the road and the, the things they encounter. Uh, to his family's experience at home and how his wife has realized well she sh probably should have paid more attention as he discussed you know where the ammunition was uh, how the generator hooked up you know where the uh, emergency food was so it goes back and forth between his experience and his family's experience and it carries through the three books there that is great so sounds i gotta i gotta get some so um you there's other ways there's audible series tell me about ways we can get the book Okay, it's available uh, through Amazon. Okay. Amazon sells the paperback, uh, they sell the Kindle version. Uh, also, it's available on Audible and iTunes. Kevin Pierce is the nar narrator who's done uh, the 299 Days series, so he's recognizable to a lot of people. But uh, people seem to love the audiobook version. Yeah, that's how I found out about it yesterday, was that you have the, the gentleman, a friend of mine, he drives around a lot, so he was able to listen to your book and he loves it. So he was. Got it. You got to meet Franklin, and you got to get his book. So, perfect, perfect. so it was good to meet you, Franklin. And um, you too. Thanks so, a lot. thank you for telling me about your books. Thanks. Appreciate it.